Hey, so uh, I got a file here from uh, a Chili Pepper user that uh, was made in CamBam. It's got a lot of G2, G3s, and um, he had just sent in a support uh, question saying that uh, he had auto-leveled um, using the, the auto-leveler feature here in uh, Chili Pepper, which is pretty cool. Uh, it's the first time I've heard uh, somebody come back and, and uh, give feedback on the auto level. Well, that's not true. It's maybe a, a, a few people have done it. Um, so I'm just going to run it here live just to actually kind of debug it. Uh, I'm going to run it really slow. So I'm going to make sure I send to the serial port. I'm going to do no pre-uploading. I will not use multi-line mode. And I'm going to delay each line by one second because I just want to run it really slow because the user is saying that um, the first four holes are not retracting and they're dragging through the work piece. So I just want to see. You can see I've got some video going here. Let's just hit play. So we start out really slow. You can see each line is only being sent per second. So we hit our we hit our M6 tool change command, which I'll make another video about because um, that's pretty new. But let's go ahead. The G17 is pretty important because that sets the XY plane for the G2, G3 commands. But let's just zoom in here and see what's happening. I think this looks good, including with those auto levels. You can see that we're we're starving the buffer here a little bit because I'm sending so slow, but I want to do that so that I could pause this like right here and pretty much be in line with where the project's at, but we'll keep going here. So that retracted. Um, that, that retracted correctly. You can see over here too, I'm in the air that I'm running this, but I'm, I'm working my way down those spirals. looks okay and then we should see it retract nicely I mean of course the positions being reported anyway correctly but this should retract yeah that looks correct moves to the next hole a little bit of a smaller hole it looks like here it looks okay um, by the way well, let's see. Yeah, that retract looked okay, too. Huh. This looks okay as well. By the way, these light yellow lines are because the simulator is does not have G2, G3 animation built in. It just follows the start and end point. And so just sort of for current users, just uh, make note of that. So, I don't know, this looks like it's running okay. Um, you know, one of the things that's interesting, you'll notice all these little ALZ mod, and you're getting all these comments, because the auto leveler injects a comment uh, of what the original value was of the Z, uh, and then what it modified it to. So, um, that's what a lot of these are. But, I don't know, this project, this job looks like it's running great. So... Let's see, that's a skinny little guy there. Ooh, 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 those feel weird. Those are weird. Well, maybe, maybe not. Hmm? I don't know. That, that acted weird, actually. That acted very weird. I'm not sure that's my auto level doing that. That could be the way those small arcs are being um, interpreted by Tiny G. These feel okay. Huh. That little guy was interesting. I gotta. Sometimes it gets really messy here. Let's see. I want to go back and actually rerun. Let's see. Yeah, these larger holes seem fine. Let's see. Yeah. Okay, uh, you know, these little guys in the middle are intriguing. I would think those would get run first. 
um, because it would be milling out the middle. So I'm not sure why it would make sense to go back in there. Maybe that's just something weird about Kanban. Huh. Oh, here's a small one. Let's watch how this runs. We'll zoom way in. No, something's a little weird about those. Maybe. And then it doesn't run that circle, so that's a little odd, and then it retracts. I think that could be the tiny G. I do remember hearing from Alden a uh, little bit of a question on GitHub about um, uh, a G2 arc maybe getting interpreted weird, and I think the user had to convert it to G1s just to get it to go correct, so maybe that's part of the issue. <clears throat> Let's see, do we have another small hole here? No, that's a big hole. That one looks okay. Okay, well, we'll go from there. Thanks for watching.